I hope you're feeling lucky because we have some great content headed your way around all things related to wireless and mobility. My name is Tom Hollingsworth, and I am the practice lead for mobility here at Tech Field Day, which is a part of the Futurum Group, and we are bringing you the 2025 edition of Mobility Field Day, coming your way May 7th, 8th, and 9th from Silicon Valley. It is a jam-packed event. We have so many presenting companies that are going to be talking to an amazing array of delegates who are very interested in these topics. I want to jump right in and talk about some of the presentations that you're going to be seeing on Mobility Field Day. We're going to be kicking off the first with Juniper because they're going to be talking about the latest capabilities for their AI assistant, Marvis, and how it can help streamline network management. We're also going to be talking a little bit about Wi-Fi deployments and how you can deliver exceptional user experiences at scale. You might even learn the secret to eliminating trouble tickets. After that, we're going to be hearing from our friends at Cisco who will be continuing a great series of successful presentations around so many different things related to wireless, to Wi-Fi 7, as well as ultra wideband. You're going to want to make sure you tune in for that because there are going to be some very smart questions from our delegate audience. Rounding out the day on Wednesday, we're going to be hearing from Solona. They're going to be showing how neutral host support can provide value added services on top of private 5G. They're also going to be demoing new updates to Solona OS for AI driven network automation and a live demo of their upcoming distributed edge architecture. We're going to be kicking off Thursday with Arista. They're going to be discussing their perspective on real world deployment of Wi Fi 7 and how digital experience monitoring can help optimize user happiness. And then they're also going to be talking a little bit about Cloud Vision Agni, which is their NAC platform that you're going to want to tune in for. Then we're going to be hearing from Fortinet. They're going to be talking about their approach to AI with products like Forta AI and Forta AI Ops and how they help simplify the operation of their platforms. They're going to be emphasizing Wi-Fi 7 adoption and also the evolution of their 5G story. And then they'll be demoing cloud-based LAN and WAN gateway management for all kinds of networking combinations, whether they be wired or wireless. And then we're going to hear from Ubiquity. You may have seen their presentation last year at Mobility Field Day, and rest assured their momentum continues on with a look at Unify as a trusted enterprise partner, as well as diving deep into their Wi-Fi 7 portfolio. Then they're going to be showing off some of the latest additions to their software platform, and I've heard that these are getting quite the buzz out there in the community. We're going to wrap up the event on Friday with our friends from Nile. They're going to be talking about security features, especially Nile's secure fabric and how easy it is to implement. And then we're going to see their effortless features uh, like zero trust and security posture improvements and how those come out of Nile Secure Fabric. And then they're even going to be giving us a special peek at some of their upcoming guest services features. And this is going to be something that they're going to be premiering for Mobility Field Day. So make sure you tune in for that. In addition to all of those great people who will be out there watching us on our website at techfieldday.com, as well as following along on TechStrong TV and on our LinkedIn page, you can see all of our amazing delegates who are some of the biggest names in the wireless and mobility space. And I want to especially call out uh, Alan Crow, who's joining us for the first time. Alan's one of those people who got himself a seat at Mobility Field Day for being a part of the conversation, even though he wasn't a delegate at Mobility Field Day last year. So congratulations, Alan, and we can't wait to hear what you have to say, along with some of the other great names, including folks like Ron Westfall, who will be joining us from the Future Room Group. And we're glad to have one of our co-workers there. If you want to follow along, as I mentioned, we're going to be streaming live on our website as well as LinkedIn. Make sure you hit up all of the social media so that you can join the conversation, ask questions, make comments, and see the discussion that our delegates are providing for the people in the community. And of course, if you want to be a part of all of this fun, make sure you leave a comment on our videos, whether it's on LinkedIn or on YouTube, because we love to hear what our community has to say. We hope that Mobility Field Day is going to be three action-packed days of great conversations and great content that you're not going to want to miss. Remember to set your calendars for May 7th, 8th, and 9th. Check out techfieldday.com for more information about the timing of those presentations, as well as information about all of our delegates and presenters. And we'll see you in Silicon Valley.